Organically fabricated, culturally uncultured, specifically unspecified, on radio podcast. Up, be a little quick today, y'all. I gotta catch up. Y'all gotta keep up. No, I'm right. And you were here with your cousins, the two in the place to be the dynamic duo with your boy LA and your girl. Hey, hey y'all know how we do. Y'all know how we do every Wednesday, 8 7 Central, live on Facebook, yeah, kmwimedia.com. Yeah. Yeah. Sitting up in here at the executive suites, baby, because uh-huh. that's the only way your boy gets down. And we are doing it one more again for the whole, whole, whole up holidays. Okay. It is Krumma time. It is Krumma time. So, what's going on, people? What's going on, world? Let me get, hey, y'all, I'm a little ash today. Y'all got to excuse me. I'm off camera. I'm a little ashy all days. It's a little ashy. <laughs> y'all can't see me with my imperfections. They don't shine through like that, like other people. So, AC, what's going on over there? I'm excited. It's Christmas you time. You lit up. Lit, lit, lit. Lit, lit, lit. Yo, 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 what's going on with what what that what that what that you got what that you got on? What did you look what? Did you look what is that you got on? Like, girl, is you dripping? Look at you drip girl. She the, somebody done graduated past a 90 days. <laughs> Look out! Congratulations oh on your promotion to being an actual employee of, <laughs> of uh, the No I'm Right Productions. Yeah. Brought to you by KMWI Media Studio. Okay, I see you. Yeah. See you. Okay. Uh, yeah. So uh, we want to say what's going on to all people that's tuning in live. What it is? We back at it. So um, today gonna be a shouty. It's gonna be a little shout. Uh, we had some uh, timing schedule. I know y'all like, man, what time is? Do you see what time? Don't worry about all that. Sometimes things happen. It's holiday season, okay? Traffic is a beast out there. Yes. I had to fire my, my third driver for the last three months, okay? It's tough. Yeah. But guess what? Because it's a show, we're going to jump right into something fantastic, though. What's that? That is the favorite segment that everybody <laughs> loves. And we're bringing it back. Unboxing mm. with LA. Yes, yeah. that's right. It, the, the the pandemic does not stop the gifts from flowing. And so the gift to me will be a gift to you visually only. How about that? <laughs> so without further ado, mm-hmm. here we go. Oh, look who it is. Our favorite friends at Nikkei. Check my- Nikkei, they coming through again. What's going on? We got a little box here. Okay. And we are to- it is time for the mm-hmm. unveiling. AC, let me go and hit that drum roll, please. What's going on? Oh, yes, this is your boys. Ho, 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 holiday. Edition hey, of these Nakai's. Nakai's. Check it out, AC. Won't you check it on out? I actually like those. Mm-hmm. I like. Look I at that. Like okay, you got you got these very festive as you see oh, the snow snowflakes. Like, yeah, look at the flakes. Uh huh. You know, it looked like a Krispy Kreme box. A- a- hello, you know, yeah. Krim- 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 Kreme Kreme box. Yeah. Look at it has all the details of the red and green for the holiday season. Mm-hmm, that's and nice. because it gets a little chilly when it's time for the holidays. So inside, do you see the plush Ooh. 
What is, is that? Is that a sheep? Velvet? What is that? It looked like a sheep. Hey, no sheeps were harmed in the making of this shoe, but I oh, promised you, no. you think it was. That's that little lamb, lamb of God, lamb, precious lamb. <laughs> Check it out. <laughs> hey, please, go long, if you will. Mm, what you think about that there? Like Talk to him. Talk to him about it. elbows, y'all. Talk to him about it. Talk to him about it. Ooh. I liked them. Oh, okay, so this is like an ugly Christmas sweater. Right in the shoe form, yeah. I like that. And it's digging, and it's, it goes great with your no. I, oh, excuse me, sorry, wrong, wrong label. Oh. With your drip king, drip queen, crema oh, pearl. Shake it, right. shake it out. It is smatchy, matchy, smatchy, smatchy. Oh, I like that. You and your friend, you can't get these, but you and your people too can get your official drip Christmas attire. Like MMTGclothing.com. I like it. Well, we're blessed. To get you dressed. Come on now. Like indeed, indeed. Okay, so <coughs> AC. And I like how the fur okay. inside. Yes. It's cooling. It is. So your feet get hot uh -oh. and cool from back then. What's that? No uh uh, we're not starting come it back? this week. That, okay, you better stop, Noah. We're we not doing that. Rebuke you, Satan. Okay. So, yeah, man, and this is very plush and oh yeah, absolutely. It's going um this is going to be a fantastic shoe to wear whenever I get around to it. Need none of these though? Well, see, that's the you thing. You need to tell Nike to start sending you half a 13. Yeah, you know, I, I got to work up to that. I mean, he, he, he know me, he don't know you. And, you know, the last guest, I mean, the last host didn't last too long. So, you know, you know, things happen. You know, they want to they make sure star power is here. So, there we go. But uh, it doesn't get much shinier than this. At all, at all, that is a spectacle and a half. I'm not Good talking job. about the damn shoe. Oh, you are talking okay. about me then? No, I'm talking about me, nigga. Oh, okay. Go okay. wide. Okay, I got you. I got you. Here we hey, go. Hey, something. Here we go. Uh huh. Yeah. Check it drip, out. Drip. So we gotta jump into it. Uh, AC, was there anything to view in sports? No. No. We ain't gonna. We ain't no sports. Cowboys won. The Cowboys have won. A did hell did it <laughs> Lord, did it cold that in hell too? Cause yeah. they didn't won the game. It's snowing somewhere. And it's Dalton. It's the red rocket rifle of Richardson showed up. Richardson. And he did his thing against them hapless, helpless bangles. Okay. So um uh, the former quarterback goes back to his old team and beats him. How cliche. I like Congratulations. It. I like it. I think I think he was saving that. Was he? Mm -hmm. So he just he only had one W to use. Only one. And, and he, he was just waiting it. till he played Cincinnati. That's it. That's that's about so I, I ain't gonna deny that one. No, no, no. I ain't gonna deny that one. Uh yeah, Don't Cincinnati Cincinnati wasn't that bad. Mm -hmm. Um the Cowboys weren't that good either. Yeah. But somehow, some way a W came about. So And if I'm not mistaken, my mighty Mavericks won as well. The Mavericks is cleaning up in the preseason. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, Luca Mania is still alive and well. Oh, is that what the is that what the drip making you do? Yeah, One it get, made me yeah okay, bit. okay. Yeah, you still my cousin. Let's calm down. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, Kenny, don't get in trouble. Uh, <laughs> I think the uh, wax skins, red wax skins, the, <laughs> the racist football of america team mm -hmm. uh i don't know just for our producer's sake we always mention he them. said wash his hands i think yeah he washed his hands of that squad okay. exactly that would be your best <laughs> bet um yeah we don't have to talk about them so um what 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 do we have come it's, it, you know it's the, my favorite time of year i see we got plenty of these drip shirts available mm -hmm. in all colors we got you know you lit it up over there with the hat it, we got it, gifts coming from nike what is your favorite time of year if it ain't this one what would be number two if this ain't number one? Oh man my birthday your birthday yeah it's your birthday it's my it's my birthday so Ew. that's what you you okay we looking for holidays oh okay not some boring holidays all right you know um, so if we can okay so outside of thanksgiving christmas new year's oh then, really, you just bundle all, all that together all okay together. okay yeah aside from that i actually enjoy black history month 
Oh, you look who trying to get some kudos from the black people. I see you with your yellow ass. Good job. I like Black History Month too. That is a good one. That is not a specific holiday. That's a month, but hey, that is yeah. a holiday. That's a holiday to celebrate my blackness. Mm -hmm. It's a holiday. That is true because right. they picked the shortest month to do it in, and that's about how much <laughs> black you have. Here. Gotcha. Understood. You know what? Black <laughs> Lives Matter made Black History Month all of 2020. Yes, uh, the worst it's a year. Shame we in, had to show, share it with COVID. Right, because yeah. that's is the absolute the worst year in history that we're gonna go ahead auto delete as soon as it's oh. over with. And um, I also understand that President Elect. I love saying that. Isn't that like wonderful? The, say, I, I'm saying again. President elect, elect Mr. Joe Biden had a speech talking about what's to come for the American public. He got me excited. So I'm trying to figure out has he dealt with that problem in the house? So here's the thing. Okay. I think that Biden is dealing with that problem the way that that problem is dealing with him being the new president elect mm -hmm, mm -hmm. he's just ignoring it oh, okay i think that's the classy thing to do so because really granddaddy mm -hmm. used to say yeah if you stand up and argue with a fool and somebody walk by they don't know who the damn fool is right yeah so people I, from a distance can't tell who is who for not feeding so would you say that would treat that problem like furniture and just slide it over in the Oh somewhere. boo! It ain't even a U-Haul. It's like an old dusty box mm -hmm. that they. It's just sitting on the steps, and mm -hmm. they all they waiting is to fold it up. Are they gonna have vacuums to to get up the orange residue that'll uh, be? They gonna okay. matter of fact, they gonna put a whole new floor in the White House. <laughs> they are gonna put a whole new mat. Forget a mattress. <clears throat> they gonna put a whole new bedroom suit in there. You know, black people go get bedrooms. Yeah. So, they gonna, they gonna they, so bedroom definitely go in the rooms to go. Okay, got they it. going to rooms to go. They going to Ashley's furniture. <coughs> Hell, they gonna come to Texas and go to Bailey's furniture. They might even go to Haverty's. It's Haverty's your store. Furniture for <laughs> your home. Right. So, uh, I've been getting some feedback, AC. Mm, you have. Okay. And uh, some feedback about the new leaf turned over for the holidays. Oh. And you know, everybody knows that last show I made a valiant attempt to change my ways for the show for the month of December. No, you didn't. I tried. Oh, you did? I tried. Okay. So, um, no, when it came to some things that was brought up, I was told to bring up the what, how far could you go to where there's no coming back? And I oh, wanted to do... No return? Yes. I oh. wanted to do the conversation without the obvious which is cheating everybody you know that's gonna always be that coin yeah, flip yeah. of whether they're gonna deal with it or not but outside of cheating mm -hmm. what is the point of no return for relationships yeah. on the non-relationship show that does not discuss relationships until we talk about relationships, relationships. yeah Huh. Point that's of no a, return, that's a really ladies. Good question. I'm because ready. Let's go. One for me mm -hmm. personally okay. is habitual lying. So just line up at everything. Yeah, you just line. You like had, like you had Chinese food, but you said you stopped at Wendy's before yeah. coming home. Yeah, what's just you lying. What you practicing? What you practicing for? Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. So okay. line is one. What's another? Uncleanliness. Oh, so a filthy ninja. Mm -hmm. So no baths, yeah. no deodorants, uh -huh. you know. But nasty, stinky, just, funky feet. And got 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 the the tank tops is yellow. Yeah, oh, you know what I'm saying. Are they so dirty that they almost see through? Right, yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. give, 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 okay, so we got what, what was the first one again? Let's run it back. Habitual line. Line, because mm -hmm. you know I will never lie again. Uh -huh. Um, and then. Being nasty, nasty and dirty and, and, mm, and nasty no, no, ninjas. no home cleaning. No <clears throat> home cleaning. What's the third what's the third thing? We were thinking three. What's the third one? I mean, you know, I guess the most important thing outside of cheating uh -huh. is fighting. Oh, fist fight. Yeah. Square it up. Yeah. Little little Vaseline under the eyes. Mm -hmm. and, Girl, let me take this earring off because I know one money can, can dang is that okay? And see, I'm at a point in my life I'm not doing that no more. No more of that. No, there's a Smith and Wesson. Cause there's you know what? Nine or 
40 and I up. think if we had mm-hmm. phones back in the day mm-hmm. that recorded, mm-hmm. you would have a prize fighting video montage <laughs> of yourself. <laughs> and I would be making several bucks off of that one there. <laughs> oh, see, that's why you can't do nothing with your kinfolk. <laughs> that's so, why they bring up all your old shit. Right. You can't so, be nobody new. The ladies say. The ladies say, we're going to go to y'all fans, too, on Facebook Live. We're going to read a few of those. Yeah. The ladies say, from AC's perspective, AC's list yeah. is going to be lying, mm-hmm. nasty, mm-hmm. and fight. And fight. Okay. So, we got a few people here. Mm-hmm. Um, let's see. Get past all the rigmarole. <laughs> let's high five everybody virtually because, again, we don't want to touch y'all, COVID people. Mm-hmm. Um we got Shatana from Philly. Okay, Shatana. I'm probably saying from her name Philly? wrong on purpose. You probably gonna get mad. Um, How's it spelled? S H E T A N A. She Tana Tona Ink Tona Tana. Candy had Candy had said disrespect is her. You know, mm-hmm. no, no, no. See, that kind of falls into, I guess. Mm-hmm. Mm, well. Yeah, disrespect is in the class of its own. And then my girl Shatana said abusiveness. That's fighting. Yeah. Okay. And so, nowadays you run into some women that'll kick your ass. So here's a no go for the men's. Mm. And you know, I'm gonna try to speak I from hands. Let me speak from the the less the less educated men's. Cause they probably don't know this, this, this is my, here's my list. Here's my list first. My list. Number one. Mm -hmm. And you know what? I have to ride with candy on that, but I think it's lack of respect for the man's position in a relationship. So no submission. I wouldn't even say submission. I think submitting to your husband, I think is a bit, I think it's been muddied. That water has been very muddied over a span of time because people are thinking submission is slavery and it's not the same thing. Yeah, no, not at all. And I think a lot of people have that misconstrued. So I'm not even mentioning submission, okay. submitting. So we'll take I think down, like giving that. respect to a man for being a man okay. in your life, in whatever capacity, if y'all dating, if y'all together, if y'all married, mm-hmm. he's the man. He's the man in the relationship. There's only supposed to be the man. Ain't no a man. He is the man in your life. Therefore, treat him accordingly. Mm -hmm. Okay? So that would be one. Uh, Two is lack of respect for finances. Ladies. I don't know who told y'all that we was made of money. (laughs) But we ain't made of money. And a lot of y'all dating those that don't go out there and get it. Mm -hmm. So how can you spend so much of his non-money that he don't have and you ain't helping get him more money but rather keep spending his money because he'll get more money eventually. That will make me leave. You know what's so funny? My mate said something. He said, nothing from something leaves nothing. Right. And nothing from nothing leaves nothing. And okay. He made, in the moment that he said it, in my mind, I was like, what are you talking about? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Let it go. You, you're trying to make a point where you can't make one. But then once I sat back and I thought about it, it was very true. Yeah. A lot of times we partner up with people that don't necessarily have the same education or mindset that we have about certain things Mm -hmm. finances being one of them right and i think that that's where that being equally yoked comes into play yeah it doesn't necessarily mean oh you got to make more money than me it just means that we have to both together be financially educated to where we can make what we do have coming in Mm -hmm work for our situation absolutely i think that beyond our means of living is a way of life Mm -hmm. as an american Mm -hmm. so we all do it right but it got to come to a point where we tap on the brakes from the louis v's yeah well we slow down on the birkin Mm -hmm. 
where we calm down on the six inch heels. You know, no different than a dude with his video games and his Jordans and all of that. You know, not everybody has Nike that is willing to send out his product to him. So we all understand not everybody has been a fitting in this world. Mm -hmm. So it's okay. Yeah. I was there too. So let's just, hey, Crystal, hey, we see you okay. back again. And Gary can't wait to come back for the show. We thank you for being there. Um, you know what? I live by a philosophy that um, Jada Pickett told Pickett? Jada Pickett Smith. Pickett Smith. Yeah, still I think she's still going Smith. Mm -hmm. What? How do I say it? Pink it. How do I say it? Pink it. Pink it. Well, Jada. Pink it. Hey, pink it. Smith. Hey, pink it. And pink it. She told Tiffany Haddish, "Never carry a bag that you can't carry the same amount of money inside of the bag." Hello. And I use that in in life today. Like, I don't. I have a really bad shoe habit myself. Facts. Okay. So I don't buy shoes that I can't keep that amount of money in my checking account. Right. So if I want to go buy a $900 pair of Louis V's, I need to have not only $900 for the shoes, but I need to have another $900 to be secure in and how I feel. And then I also need to have some extra money. Right. And then like a lot of other women, I keep mad money too. So, you know, every week Why or so I go mad? pull, you know, maybe a hundred or $200 out of my account and put for? it in a drawer. You're mad for so I, I i i can respect i can get down with with that okay so just to recap because ac got on that money tangent I, and i love I, it though i, I love it. it a woman that understands the value of a dollar i love it <laughs> so start with one man, man respect respect it number two the testosterone. finances okay number three mm -hmm. and this is very important mm -hmm. Number three, don't say video game. Is showing some doggone appreciation. Well, does it not go with no, it don't go with none of that. Respect appreciation is a totally different thing. From the problem is, is okay. that you expect so much. You expect everything. You expect us to do this. You expect us to provide, to take care of, to treat you like a queen, to tell you not fat in that dress, to sit up there and put food on the table, to take them badass kids when you want to go to a spa day with your girlfriends. You expect everything. But do you appreciate it? That's the difference. It's the fact that a man don't get no appreciation. We just get expectation. You expect us to do it. And the moment we don't do it, the moment it ain't just given to you, it's a problem. And it's a problem that you have, man. Not the problem we don't appreciate it and we just don't feel appreciated. See, women claim to not get, not get no appreciation all the time. They always claim to be lack of appreciation, to be bereft of appreciation. But it's not true. Because all the time we saying, thank you, babe, thank you, babe, thank you, babe, appreciate you, babe, thank you, babe. But not once can a man get the same appreciation. And when we don't, and somebody else out there gives it to us, we run it with it. It's not to say it's right. It's just saying it's the point of no return. If I feel like I can't be appreciated in my own home, that ain't my home no more. You dig? Kenny, don't apply that shit. Ha <laughs> ha. There we go. So. Now listen. Okay. okay. Talk to me. <clears throat> Talk to me, baby. Not all women are like that. Oh, here we go. So are you the telling me in all excuse. of the relationships you've been in, you've never felt appreciated? I feel that women have an mm -mm, That ain't what I asked you. I asked you in all of the relationships you've been in, have you never felt appreciated? No. You're not going to tell the host how I did. to answer the question. Answer the question that I asked you. Don't give me I'm going to answer the question. Right. But okay. I'm going to answer it the way I answer mm -mm. I need you to say yes so or no. So I get <laughs> appreciation. However, y'all put expiration dates on appreciates. Okay? Y'all may set it for a certain time. Y'all put the little timer on there. Once the timer, ding. Wants to go off, you done appreciating, you expectating. That's it. So are you saying mm -hmm. that the expectation exceeds the appreciation? Facts, not false. So I expect for you to watch the kids while I'm away. 
I expect for you to take the trash out every day. I expect for you to maintain the household when I'm away. On the flip side of that, surely you expect the same things from me, correct? That's teamwork make the dream work. Okay. But we ain't taking out the trash, huh? Who is we? We ain't making sure that we read the 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 little alert on the car to say it's time to go get your oil change. Oh, see, no, nah, I take care of all my stuff myself. We ain't seeing that the same baby food been smeared on the hood of the car when you <laughs> set the baby on there and ain't drove to a car wash yet. We ain't noticed that you've been riding around in flats knowing that I work overnight and don't get to see you by the time you gone and you still ride the same flat. Oh, Lord. That's a lot of we that ain't going mm. on right now. Mm. And speaking of we, we need to go back. Which one of you husbands done hurt his feelings this week? We need to go back to the finances of things real quick. Okay. And let's touch on the age old question. Again, y'all, it's a shorty. So this one going to end it off. But what we need to talk about this. How much is enough to pay to put some jewelry on your finger? Are you talking about an engagement ring or just any kind of jewelry? That's a shame that we have to dwindle it down like that because y'all <laughs> asses get too <laughs> much anyway. So just what? for its and giggles, let's call it an engagement ring. Okay. How much money is enough? You know what? It could be $2. Girl, if bye. The ring is what I bye. want. Cut a mic out because she's lying. The truth ain't in them. It's got to be what I want. Now, we know I ain't going to want no $2. So then why are we even talking about the last $2? Because I don't think women look at price when it comes to engagement rings. We look at the sentimental Is this? Is Are you going against your own first rule of no return? Because you absolutely is lying right about now. A now ring that a man can give a woman that she ain't going to many a praise in her head to figure out how much he didn't actually threw down for this ring. Why did he say that? <laughs> she going to do that. She going to look at it. She might even get it appraised in the jewelry shop. Forget appraising it in her mind. Y'all ain't. <laughs> I didn't say that. That's a shame. Yeah. As I have said many times. <laughs> let me read the comment real quick. Let's see. Okay, okay. So, Miss Teresa agrees that a woman reacts the way a man responds to her. Girl, bye. Because, again, y'all don't ever take ownership for nothing. That's y'all problem. <laughs> Everything y'all do is based off of what somebody else did. I only went off at the girl at work because she looked at me crazy. I only quit my <laughs> job because my boss didn't respect me. I only went and slapped you in your face because I told you to take the trash out two times and you got in my face saying, don't I got two arms too? You know, everything <laughs> got to be because somebody else did something. When are you women going to be accountable for making bad decisions on your own and own it? That's why I always say the age old adage stays the same. Women can't live with them. Can't live without them. That's Can't it. live without them. Nothing more. The best of a worse situation yeah, is finding a woman. I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, so again, let's read the rest of this. Okay. Uh, and uh, hold on, contradictory to what she just got through saying, Teresa says that a woman reacts the way a man responds to her. She just came back and said, Well, team works make the dream work. Which one is it? <laughs> Which one Teresa, is it? You're Teresa, you're making my job hard. Which one is it, boo boo boo? Which one? Okay, Candy over talking about if it is what I like, less than a thousand dollars. Ken. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Baby. We don't look at the price tag on Baby. the ring until after we get it. We just Baby. want the ring that we want. If it's what you like at Dollar Tree, <laughs> it should be just fine. <laughs> because you talking about a thousand. It ain't what I like. Ain't what I like. Ain't what I like. No, 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 no. Ain't what I like. Okay, so can we buy you knockoff Jordans? Now, see, that's that's not the same. <laughs> Nobody is saying knockoff anything. What? Nobody's saying knock Well, off that's anything. the only way we're going to get Jordans for $20. Okay, I, I, I understand 20 is a stretch. Okay, I, uh, you know, there's some gray area, lots of gray in between. <laughs> 
But I'm saying that I you don't need case. no thousand dollar ring mm -hmm. when K K Jewelers might be doing a special right now right. for about three ninety nine. It's sold, and it means same thing. If I okay? like it, it means same thing, same thing. So, uh, what is this? Crystal said, "If I can see it, facts. Long as you can see it, boo." Long as when I hold up the finger, there's something circular around but right there. But you know there. what? That, that the simplest ring can cost you twelve thousand dollars. That's fine because it won't get twelve. It won't get eleven thousand nine hundred and ninety nine of mine. I can tell you that. So appreciate y'all for tuning in. This is a show. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you AC, guys. you got anything you need to go for? I, I'll no, let these just folks be out. safe. Keep you know. We welcome your Christmas cheer. Just wear your mask from ear to ear. Oh, isn't that cutesy wootsy sweetsy peetsy? Yeah. Make sure that y'all keep tuning in every week. We got every more week. laughs, more fun. Next week we'll be here. We will also that will be the Christmas show. Next week. Cause next week it's Christmas. It's Christmas. Christmas. It's Christmas time next week, baby. So next week tune in to the No I'm Right Christmas yeah. Extravaganza. We need to play some. Christmas and then a week Christmas. after that, we are gonna have the No I'm Right New Year's Extravaganza. Uh. And we may take a week off. We don't know. I don't know. It just depends on how much you're going to pay me for being here at uh, k and ah, Okay? <laughs> so we want to take y'all and give a tune in. Cutting Up Season 2 of uh, Cutting Up With LA Season 2 is going to be on the production. We also got some nice content coming directly from the KMW Media Studios as well. Be on the lookout for that. That's a little teaser right now. We're going to take you through that. Also, tune in to all past, present, and future episodes of Norm Right on the YouTube channel. YouTube. That is youtube.com forward slash no I'm right 100. Seeing all questions, comments, concerns, basically anything I just don't care about, to no I'm right 100 at gmail.com. And do not look for us on Twitter. We don't know Instagram or Facebook. Twitter, we just don't have enough characters for AC people. Just saying. Okay? We're going to stay lit, lit, lit for the whole, whole holidays. And we out from the executive suite to KMW Media Studios. It's Dallas' favorite son with his favorite cousin AC. Signing out. Golden rule as always. I'm always right, people. We always right. We always right. Merry Christmas. Bring it to LA on a go. Let it trash on a flow. Make it move. It chick drip king CEO. Huh. Feel it. Talk about feelings. Man, I never really know. But it was Emmy. Get up, Jimmy. Not his record.